Well, look at what I got here. English, Dutch, and French. Uh, I don't know about you, but I think English is the best one. I mean, you know, since I understand it. Oh, crap, there's a password. Um, one, 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 um, one. Enter. <laughs> well, okay, I didn't actually expect that to work. Anyways, welcome to UFO. Enemy unknown. Dun dun dun. So, yeah, this is a really awesome classic turn based strategy game. Um, you take part as the humans in a alien assault, aliens trying to take over the world. Um, very in depth. I'm gonna go beginner because, or not beginner, pff, no, screw that. I'm gonna go experienced because I have played the game before and also because I don't wanna go too hard because I want to actually complete this game, but I don't want to, uh, I'm going to try to Iron Man it, so that, you know, if, um, if any of my people die, then, you know, they're dead, um, because normally you can save in battle, and it's kind of, you know, cool and stuff, so, what I'm going to do, what I usually do, is I put my first base over here in Europe, right about... Eh, I don't know. I know. I guess we'll put our first one over here. Right smack dab in the middle of the country. This is gonna our first base is gonna be XCOM because that's the name of our organization. USA branch. Enter. All right, and then with that, the game immediately begins. Now I should probably explain things a little bit. Um, basically, what's happened is it is. Dang it. Uh, go back. It is um, 1999. Aliens have now confirmed their own existence, and they are now openly abducting people. Um, for just for giggles, apparently. But you know they don't come back. Um, they've been destroying cities, all kinds of jacked up stuff. So the oh snap, we've already detected a UFO. Um, let's see where is it. Wow, it's coming right for us. Alright, so... Sorry, I was trying to explain things, but the game's like, No, you can't explain things. You gotta play. I'm like, okay, fine, jeez. So we're gonna send out an interceptor. Alright, there it goes. Wait, it passed it. What? What? No, come, come back. Okay, we've, we've intercepted it. What is it? Alright, it looks like a very small scout. Um, aggressively attack. So this is our this is our ship here. Oh crap! It ran away. Come back. Come back. Okay, we're intercepted again. Um, sadly, we, since we have only current human technology. Oh wow! We just completely destroyed it. Um, so yeah, we only have regular missiles and gun bullets right now. So we need to work on that. Okay. So the first thing we need to do is go to base. This is our base. This is XCOM USA branch but branch won't fit in there um, so we got three hangers this is a sky ranger right here that's our, like our troop transport this is uh, our two interceptor bays and that's what we send out to shoot down UFOs so those are good now we have our our agents our XCOM agents these are all of them um, what else do we have um, we yeah we need to research need to research stuff right away. First thing you always research laser weapons immediately. Put all the scientists on it because um, right now we just have assault rifles which need, use bullets. So yeah that's kind of un for you know it's not good because you know you need to reload them and stuff. Laser weapons you never need to reload them ever. So that's what we're going to be doing is using laser weapons for most of the game. So, let's see, let's equip our craft. Here's our Sky, Sky Ranger. So all of our crew is uh, equipped on the Sky Ranger. Let's see what weapons we have. Pistols, no. Pistol, no pistol clips. Rifles, yeah, they can stay. Rifle clips, put a few extra on there. Heavy cannon, uh, heavy cannon and ammo. 
We have a rocket launcher. We do. Put the rocket launcher on there and put the rockets on there. And we'll take the grenades. Alrighty. So that's, that's just going to be the stuff that's on our troop transport when our troops are sent to somewhere where there's aliens. So now that I've actually found a pause screen, I can take the time and explain <laughs> the backstory. Um, I started to, but then, you know, there was that. Anyways, so, we are XCOM, a, a uh, organization set up by, I guess, the United Nations, I, I guess. It doesn't really go into that. But, basically, we um, are set up to pretty much protect the world from aliens. Um, all nations of the world um, pay us funds for protecting them um, and if we do good they will increase our funding and if we do crappy they will uh, reduce our funding and if we do horrible they'll withdraw from the XCOM project altogether and not give us any more money and they'll try to figure out things on them by themselves however that that just doesn't work at all because um, they can't that basically if a, if a nation withdraws from the XCOM project you can pretty much assume they've already been taken over by aliens by, you know, by some kind of disguised technology or whatever, so they think that their leader is their leader and it's actually an alien. However, XCOM can't just walk into, you know, government buildings and shoot people and say that they're aliens, because that just wouldn't go over very well. Um, so yeah, basically you want to keep all the nations happy um, cause then you get money, money is good, cause then you can build more stuff and more upgrades. Speaking of which, uh, we need to recruit some more people, we need to build some more facilities. We need, what do we need? I think we only need one hangar, or I mean we only need two hangars so we can get rid of this one. Um, yeah, so let's, let's sell one of our interceptors, um, sell, sell one interceptor. Wait, I don't get any money from selling a jet? Are, are you serious? That's kind of retarded. Dismantle. Okay, so now we have more room to put stuff. Um, so we need to build, build some more facilities. We need an alien containment. Put that there. Uh, gen more general stores. Um, living quarters, and I think that's enough for now. Oh wait, no, we need a large radar array. Boom. Alright, so living quarters is how many um, people you can have living in your base. Alien containment lets you keep aliens that you did not kill, and then you can interrogate them and learn their technologies. General store is just where you keep all your stuff, and large radar system means that we can scan farther for ships. Okay, so the next thing we want to do is rename our soldiers. Um, let's see here. Helen Taylor. This is probably <laughs> this is probably the most funny part of the game, is renaming people. Who can you be? Um, Helen. There we go. Laura. Diet, Dieter Mayer. Um, hmm. He's got pretty good strength, pretty good bravery. This can be Bobbert. Um, Bobbert is or was pretty much the best unit I had the first time I played the game. He survived from the very beginning all the way till the very end of the game. So I always add Bobbert in there when I play this game. Sata Iwaski. Now, is that a man or a woman? Because it doesn't tell you here. Um, you can be Jack. As in Samurai Jack. Patricia. Oh. Hmm. Lady name. Do. -do. Samus. Ed. Um, no. You got no bravery. Um, you can be, <laughs> you can be double D. Uh, 
Gerard. You got some decent bravery. This can be my good friend, Tyrone. What else? Gundren, Mayor. There's another Meyer. Um, <laughs> you can be. Oh, wait, no, that's right. Um, crap. A high spell soldier. <laughs> I failed. Um, Harry! It's coward killing time! Um, who should you be? <laughs> Clavin Klein, the XCOM agent. No. Um, hmm. Is it? No, no, no. Uh, dang it, gotta think of a name. Um, ah. Obo Joe. Alright, so that's it. We've renamed all of our people. There we go. Awesome. Now, um,. Oh wow, I spent like half my money on these new facilities and they take forever to build. Um, let's see, I need to purchase some more scientists so I can research things faster. I was spelling it right. Dang it. I was unconfident in my spelling abilities. Alright, so we'll take as many scientists as we can possibly hold. Okay, maybe not that many. We'll take ten. Um, we'll take a few more engineers to build things. Now listen, buddy. I'm an engineer. And that means I solve problems. But not kind of problems like what is beauty. Because that would fall on the purview of your conundrum. Or whatever he says. I forget. <laughs> yeah. I solve practical problems. Like how am I going to stop that mean Mother Hubbard from telling me a superfluous new behind? The answer? Use a gun. Alright, we've researched laser technology. Now we can research laser pistols. Even though we're not going to be using them. Alright, our scientists and engineers have arrived. So we can start them on stuff. Base. Um, actually, I think it might be time to end the video. To cut here so it's not a massive upload. So, alright, I'll see you next time on XCOM. Or wait, no, UFO, Enemy Unknown, even though it's the same game.